Our balls. It has been so much fun. We've had a tremendous time for our ocean celebration. Thank you to all the parents and uh, community members who helped make it such a wonderful learning experience for our students. They got to get up close and personal with some sea creatures and got to explore some of the tools that people use in uh, professions involving the ocean, marine biology, all of that good stuff. So it's been a really great time. Hemos tenido una, o pues unas semanas muy divertidas aquí en Hatch, celebrando los océanos, así que vivimos tan cerca del océano. Uh, gracias a todos los padres y me miembros de la comunidad que nos ayud ayudaron en uh, arreglar este esta celebración. <laughs> I don't know about you, but when I want to dance, I gotta wear my dancing hat. So put on your dancing hat, whatever that looks like. Sea Star, are you ready to dance for a clean, happy ocean? Yes, I'm ready. Happy ocean, ladies. Yeah. Do the time for boogie. Now, friends, we have to take a moment. Nice job drawing that. The top side, very cool. I don't want to get too far away from these because if something does happen, I'm going to need these right there. And um, talk to people. So when I'm way out in sea, I can press here and talk to, you know, anything at Zach or my dispatch. What can you guys tell me about this creature in front of you? Oh, is it a kelp forest? It is purple and it can kill people. It's hard to get to kill people. What's it called? They grow in the subtitle near the near the tidal range, but in the subtitle area. Um, they have a thicker stipe. What he's going to want to do is grip onto me. Oh, it just feels like. Something that crabs can do. Uh, let's say that I'm a big hungry seagull. Hey, nice job. All right. <laughs> First born, they have this extra thick white fur. Can I feel it? How did they die? You know, this one we won't touch too much. You touched the inside. It feels so scared. There is nothing to be scared of. Seashells. What did you get? Yes. 